So look, man, we back at again with another video. And today I came across this interesting video by Sneeko. Okay, this is, is everybody racist. So I guess he go around and asking people, are they racist or not? And I feel like this would be a good topic to talk about because, you know, on this channel, we get into a lot of like racism. We talk about racism. We talk about the woke culture. We talk about so many different stuff on this channel. And I feel like this topic right here will be a great fit for the channel. So go ahead, hit the like button, subscribe to the post notification. I think y'all will really enjoy this video because I know I will. All right. Shout out to my boy, Sneeko. The man just hit one mil. Woo, 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 woo. That sound like a freaking dog. I'm never doing that again. But anyways, man, hit the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, follow your boy on IG. You feel me? What is y'all doing? Follow your boy on IG, man. What I've already done is man, your boy the pant. What? I just I was gonna do my outro in it. You know what? I'm talking too much. Let's go. What's the last racist thought you had? I'm a black woman. You asked you seriously asked me that question? Oh my goodness. That's a good Okay, hold on. We not go pause already. Okay, we not go pause already. We go. We, I'm a black woman. You asked him. You seriously asked me that question? Oh my goodness, that's a good, that's a good question. I would say I don't really have racist thoughts. No racist Cap. thoughts in here. Cap. Why can't white people rap? I slanted my eyes because an uh, Asian kid. I was. What? Have you never heard of Eminem? Oh my gosh, this man said, "Why can't white people rap?" No racist thoughts in here. Why can't white people rap? I slanted my eyes because an Asian kid had all the answers in class. It's the people, certain people, that I don't trust. Do you trust the government? No. No. Not really. I trust them when it came down to give me PUA. I trust this government more than anybody else, though. Government means mind control. Why well, don't? Because of what the government has done to my people for the last thousand years. What people are you referring to? Are you referring to just black people or are you referring to a group of us? Okay, because the government has screwed us all, not just black people. So I will hope that you're not just referring to one particular race. All right. That was in just I thought it was like 400. 400, but I'm, I'm, I'm. Do you think the Illuminati is real? I'm so confused on that topic. They are, yeah, they, they do exist. I don't, I haven't done any research in that area. Flat Earth, astrology, uh, Flat Earth, MK Ultra, yep. What makes you think the Earth is flat? Think? No, I don't think. What makes you think that you're living on a spinning ball globe? I would say I don't really have racist thoughts. I can't backtrack on when's the last time I had a racist thought because I'm just not that type of person, you know, but. Man, cut it out. We all, bro, we all have racist thoughts. All right. Let me just tell you like that. We all have racist thoughts. Each and every last one. The person watching this video, yes, you. Yes, you. You said something racist about two weeks ago or maybe even a month ago. We all have racist thoughts. Okay. All of us. We all think about, we all have these, we all just racist in one way or another. Okay. Don't say you never had a racist thought, bro. You done said some racist stuff before. In your mind, out loud, you done said something racist before. But, uh... Not even in traffic? Nah. <laughs> I mean, and, and if, if, if racist is... He's stuttering. He capping. Being, uh, sometimes hating the human race, then yes. I'll be like, you know, fucking humans. Like, come on, like, why can't you get it together? You're fucking human. Exactly. I mean bro, ain't no way somebody sit up there and say, God dang, man, I'm a freaking human. I hate my life. Ah! Like, who does that, bro? Don't nobody do that. Come on now. <laughs> I'm a freaking human. I can't never get nothing right. Like, <laughs> he's such a liar right now, man. I don't believe you at all, yo. <laughs> I'm serious. I'm so serious. I really don't have racist thoughts. That's, that's just the honest truth. You wouldn't join the Illuminati. <sighs> See, I'm a black woman. You asked him, you seriously asked me that question? Well, you're wearing a mask, so it looks like you trust the government a little bit. See, I'm a black woman. Do I trust the government? Yeah, do you trust the government? No. You, as an Asian American, do you trust the government? No, I don't. Okay. So I don't First of all, I'm just confused on what you being black got to do with anything. My sister, what does you have been, what does you being a particular race got to do with anything, bro? Okay, what do what does it have to do with anything? I'm black. I'm a black woman. Do it look like I trust the government? Like, uh, okay. Uh, there's a lot of black people out here that do trust the government. So, what does you being black has to do with anything, bro? For the last time, stop putting race on every single thing, bro. 
You know what I'm saying? Just because you black don't mean that you're not supposed to trust the government. It's a lot of black people out here that trust the government. It's a lot of black people out here that voted for Biden. It's a lot of black people out here that still hate Trump, even after what all Biden has done, okay? <laughs> so please don't say, hey, because I'm a black woman. Like, bro, nobody cares about your race, all right? The government hated, the government that screwed us all. Asian, black, Hispanic, Chinese, rest, purple, green, orange, blue. Government screwed us all. It don't matter what race you are, okay? The the whole world, the whole culture don't like nobody, all right? We all against each other. Every race. Every race is against each other, bro. We try not to be. Well, at least I try not to be against my own people. And I'm not saying black people. I'm talking about my own people as in white, Hispanic, because, hey, we all want. That's how I look at it. We all want. United States of America. United. That's the key word. United. <laughs> you feel me? But the government has split us up, and they got people thinking that, oh, you know what I'm saying? I'm a particular race, so why would I do this? I'm a particular race, so why would I trust that? Bro, screw this all, man. Anybody should. We're one and the same. Okay. That's the number one problem. The divisiveness of America. It, it don't make no sense. Talk your stuff the in. The Asians over here, the blacks over here. It don't yeah. make no sense. We all bleed the same color. Yeah! I'm sorry. I didn't even mean to say what I said. I apologize. My apologies, my sister. I didn't see. I, that's why you should have finished watching the video. I didn't even know you was gonna say that. I come on, chair scoot up. I didn't even know you was gonna say that. My apologies, my sister. My apologies. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Talk your stuff then. Asians are over here, the blacks are over here. It don't make no sense. We Facts. all bleed the same color. Yes. We need to be fighting these people, the elite. That's how, how do we do that? You know. I don't no, a lot of us are pretty stupid. I, I mean, I, I I I could tell you how to do it, but you be in jail, fucking with me. <laughs> hey. Everybody experiences racism, and I think everybody is a little bit racist because we're brought like, bro, like, do you expect a a, a five year old to be even if it's like the greatest five year old you've ever met? Do you expect that five year old to be less racist than a newborn baby? No, because a newborn baby's on like a clean slate. Like, yo, that guy's wearing a New York University hoodie, and I'm wearing a New York University shirt. I kind of trust that guy. Right? Like, there's just from like life experience, you can definitely. He could be a serial killer, and we have no idea. He could be, yeah. And that's why racism isn't right. What was the last that's racist true. thought you had? <laughs> don't lie, don't lie. Oh, no. You say it, I'll say it. Mm, no racist thoughts in here. <laughs> oh, no. You're clean, you're innocent, um, you're perfect. Not perfect. But who gets blamed for being racist? Obviously, white people. White people? Yeah. It's is just in your blood. I feel like if you're white, in a sense, it's just in your, it's in you. No, I think, I think everybody, bro, everybody can be racist, bro. Because a person is white does not mean that that person is racist. I don't know what people, I don't know what people get that whole, it's just in your blood type of thing. Like, bro, I met so many cool white people that's literally cool. I mean, like, honestly, bro, there's so many dope white people out here, bro, but y'all only go off. Oh, I did this to my ancestors. Oh, my ancestors. Oh, bro, this is not the 1800. You feel me? Like, come on, bro. Like, I feel like half of these white people is not even the same. You know what I'm saying? Granted, it is some racist white people out here, but it's also some racist black people. It's also some racist Asians. It's a lot of people that's racist. We all racist in our own way. You know what I'm saying? I admit it that I have racist thoughts sometimes. I say racist things sometimes. I, I admit that. I do. I definitely do admit it. But one thing I'm not going to say is that only white people can be racist. It's only in white people blood. No, it's not. God created us all from his image. So therefore, if God created us all from his image, why would he only make white people the racist ones? Bro, everybody is racist in their own way, bro. Everybody's racist in their own way. Even back then, everybody had racism in their own way. I'm pretty sure no black people hated them white people. I'm pretty sure they was probably calling them white people all types of names. They slave master all type of names in their head. They probably couldn't say it out loud because they probably would have got their butt booked. But you know what I'm saying? I'm just saying, like, I'm pretty sure they was racist too. Uh, we just don't know. Everybody has that. I don't think that white people are, are any more racist than me or you. I think it all comes from the same place. Yeah. Yeah. You agree with that? I feel agree with that. Because of my thoughts. You Tell me one. Tell me one thought. No, no, no. It'd be something about like, uh, like, I was like, I think it was in class one time and I was like, he has all the answers and I slanted my eyes. It was a while ago. That's what I'm. Is that what? I slanted my eyes because an Asian kid had all the answers in class. So I was like, just pointed at That is some middle that? school stuff right there, uh, bro. <laughs> I've had that happen to me. I'm in school. Okay, so you, you have the capability to be racist. Yeah, but I'm not. Based on that, you are. 
I guess. You're probably gonna not gonna do that. Like what? What? You're half black? Something? I'm Dominican and black. You're probably not gonna be making racist jokes to Dominican and black people. Yeah. Maybe Dominican people, but like not black people. What are you gonna say to Dominican people? I don't know. Something about the way they speak. Gang, gang. Gang, gang. That's the vibe. You <laughs> think everybody's racist? Yes. For sure. I like you. <laughs> like you too, brother. <laughs> you think it all come? Why? Explain that a little bit. Well, it's just like it's just like ingrained in our in our culture and our system. You know, I'm Latin, and like even Latin people are like even more so. You know, more prejudiced and shit. You know, you see it from all angles. No, no, I, I I'm not racist. No. Cap. Okay, I see what you mean. I guess I can be racist. Like anybody can be racist, but is that like a mindset that I have? like? No, you know. I don't think I really have racist thoughts. Why did you say, hmm? What did she just say? <laughs> what did she just say? I feel like she was just talking. <laughs> I feel like she didn't even understand the question for real. I think, like, something that I've learned is just that everyone has implicit biases. Um, and it's, like, our job to always uncover that. Because, like, no matter what, like, I think everyone is somewhat racist just because of your upbringing. Unless you're anti, like, actively anti-racist, you are, to some extent, maybe, imp like, implicitly, internally racist. And you have to, like, work on that yourself. Even people who are really, like, outwardly anti-racist, I still think that they're part of the problem, too. I mean, like, it's just mostly for show and to feel good and post something on social media. Everybody been racist. Like, if you... If you look me in your eye and say that you've never been racist before in your life, you know you're lying to yourself. The government, as far as the government's concerned, you see our president, all these black people that voted him in, I hope they know that that's the same president that was sending their uncles and their nephews and their brothers and their fathers to jail for minor weed offenses. Kamala Harris talking about? My, listen, just because they're my color, don't mean that I trust them. Oh, bro, I feel so bad. I feel so bad. I guess I felt bad because she was like, oh, I'm a black woman. Are you serious? Ask me. I guess that's why I felt kind of like, you feel me? That's why I kind of went off a little bit. But now that I'm hearing her responses, I'm actually messing with my sister. Okay, I'm messing with her. You feel me? She actually talking to us tough. At first, I ain't gonna lie. I was kind of like, you know what I'm saying? Like, hold on. Like, what, what is you on? You feel me? I'm black. Like, you know, she kind of came off a little, you feel me? But... Hey, she yeah, she got some she got she got some valid points. Cause trust and believe me, it's bad enough that the way that my culture is, my black people, it's so it's so bad to the point where it's like I don't like okay, if y'all don't know, I live in I live in Chicago. I was raised and born here. I was raised on I was born out born out born out west, okay, on the west side of Chicago and moved to the south side. But it's so scary that now I'm in the suburbs, I'm so scared to go back to my my original place that I was born. You know, a lot of people go back to their hometown, like to the original place they was born just to visit. It's so bad out there that I'm so scared. And it's nothing but black people. It's a black neighborhood. It's nothing but straight black people, okay? Like, I don't think you will ever see one white person, one Mexican, like it's just straight black people. And it's so bad out there. So bad in ghetto, it's ridiculous. Now I'm not saying all black people are like that. I'm not saying that all neighborhoods, all black neighborhoods are like that, but it's just bad that this is how my culture has uh like put themselves like all they do steal kill shit. like that's all i see on the news is a, a another black man doing something stupid doing something stupid <sighs> i'm not gonna lie i have no clue what that came from i don't know i don't even know <laughs> what that had to do with any of this video but i just have to say that okay i don't to what extent should we trust power don't we need to trust people in power a little bit to have society function as you see the elite is what's winning the elite is what is what's stepping all over the little person they that's need to win to stay the for them to be elite they need to yeah i mean that's the way of the world but it is what it is, it is what, it is. <laughs> what level should we trust the government this little booklet right here i suggest you get this it's called the Unanimous Redeclaration of We the People, Affidavit of Status. It's got a bunch of codes. So, what's your full name? Okay, well, either way. <laughs> Basically, you don't trust them at all. There's, there's zero level of trust. I'm not saying that. There's zero level of trust. I'm just saying that they've been taking advantage of us, and we are supposed to be the government. 
We're supposed to be the government. We're supposed to be self-governing, correct, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. And they basically control us on all fronts. They want to microchip humanity. They want to digitize humanity by 2030. Yeah. That's not even a conspiracy. That's just true. That's true. If yeah. you go to the airport, you walk into the plane, they have like the HSBC bank signs and they're saying like, we're going to barcode you. Yeah, yeah, barcode That's you. It's supposed to be like a cool, quirky thing, but like literally a barcode. People, uh... I mean, you have to show our papers now, like Nazi Germany, like literally yeah. going into a place showing yeah. papers. That's some... Show this paper, put your photo there, even drop some of your blood on there if you want to. Sounds crazy, I know. I don't look yeah, at That's it. a little bit, that's a little much. <laughs> well, listen, man. Do you believe in the Illuminati? Uh, no. You don't think they exist? I think some form of it exists but not the illuminati form maybe not that term but maybe there's a group of rich people who touch kids around the world and have secret meetings with mass and they control the banking system yeah i think some of that some, something like that something like that some, some version of that okay, okay. out there could exist. maybe illuminati is not the best term but that is pretty much right some, some sort of rich people that that sit around and touch kids and make plans you know have like nice masks and mansion parties and everything squid games bro squid games <laughs> would you go if you were invited an illuminati party Right, they're just going to touch me and make plans, you know. And would you join us like one of the, the guys, you know? For sure. You're joining? Yeah. I think I'm joining too. That, that's the fucked up part. Dark side, man. Money and power, man. That's what it does. You want to be one of those guys at Squid Game sitting at the top with the mask on, like the fat, you know what I'm saying? I want to be that. Exactly. Uh, but in general, I think like our government is pretty well intending. The American government is well intended. No, no, no. That's what you just said. Okay, yeah, I did say. That's exactly what you just said. God damn. I'm, I'm, uh, I watch these videos and I know that the people that like fuck up their words and shit. The full one hour version of the one minute podcast. Ah, uh, all right, man. So, shout out to Sneeko. All right, shout out to me. That was actually my first time watching Sneeko. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Young Don, Young Sauce God. It's young Sauce, God. I don't know. Never mind. Okay, but shout out to them. All right, shout out to Sneeko. That's how I found out about Sneeko from Young Sauce Don or whatever his freaking name is. That's how I found out about Sneeko. So if y'all do want to check out Sneeko, man, go ahead and check him out. You feel me? So this video right here was actually pretty dope. You know what I'm saying? This pretty, uh, pretty dope just hearing other people's opinions, hearing different people, like perspectives. Is everybody racist? You feel me? Me personally, I believe that everybody is racist in their own way. I feel like we are all racist you know what i'm saying like literally it's like if you tell me that you're not racist bro you're lying you're lying we are all racist even if you even if you uh damn what's the word i'm looking for uh shoot what is that word i always forget the word um stereotype if, if you stereotype somebody bro you know what i'm saying no matter how often you do it no matter how much you do it i still feel like that could that could be a form of racism you know what i'm saying that could be a form of racism that's how I look at it. So don't say that you're not racist because you're definitely racist. All right. You said one racist thing. I'm pretty sure why driving you done said, you know, a lot of racist things. Okay. It could be towards black, white, Hispanic, Chinese, agents, anything. You feel me? Anything. Uh, but anyways, man, we're going to go ahead and get off this video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hit that like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications. I love each and every one of y'all, man. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.